and Tao with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Well, as you can see, it's a state of emergency for DJ Cal, and he needed to call in the big guns, little baby, and Drake because his album was not going to sell. The analytics said nobody cares, nobody cares anymore, and you know it's the same antics. What, what does he do when it's the same antics? He pulls out the Drake card. Okay, Drake's coming in to bail him out, give him that Midas touch. Drake and little baby, you can't miss. Okay, so. He's uh, dropping this, you know, what is it? God, God did. That's his album. They didn't believe God did. He keeps thinking they are going to take him out. Who is they? Nobody knows who they is. Who are these they that are coming after him? He should let us know who they are because we should watch out for they. But uh, anyways, he's dropping this single this week. Probably going to be good because it's Drake and Little Baby. Uh, you know, Coward's going to yell all over it. You know, it'll be another we the best. Then we got Kodak Black talks more about his arrest. Feels like he was racially profiled and that they're trying to uh, pretty much shut him down. And I, I would have to agree. I mean, you know, he, he beat a lot of charges and was, was pardoned by the president. A lot of cops probably couldn't handle that because Kodak Black was a menace back in the day. But now he is, uh, you know, turning his life around and trying to do better, do a lot for the community. And, you know, they, they, they're they messing with him. They're following him, they're pulling him over. And, you know, I hope he's able to beat all those charges. Then we got the fake little baby, heads up rolling. I mean, he does, he performs at Rolling Loud. That's pretty crazy. Uh, he's still a fake little baby. We got to fake everything out. We got a fake little Dirk, fake Drake, fake little baby. We even got a fake Travis Scott that's not really catching any I don't know if you've seen the guy walking out of the Rolls Royce in Manhattan, then walking through Manhattan with a girl that looks like Kylie Jenner. That's fake Travis Scott. That's another thing that's happening. But anyways, fake little baby actually performs at Rolling Loud. I got to give it to him. He got it to Rolling Loud, you know, so that's that's pretty dope. Can't, can't, can't deny that. Um, <clears throat> then lastly, what do we got? This guy performs at Rolling Loud. What was the last thing we had? Ah, Joe Budden talks about uh, maybe ba battling DMX when DMX was shooting Belly with Nas in Jersey. He tried to set up a, a battle with DMX. <laughs> Nobody wants to see that. I mean, I'm going to be honest with you. I like Joe Budden. Joe Budden's nice. So is, uh, you know, of course, DMX is one of the nicest to do it. But uh, who knows well, who would have won that back then. Joe Budden's nice, but they're, they're totally different artists to me. Uh, DMX is more aggressive. Joe Budden's more rapidy rap. It's Jordan Tao with JT News. I'll check you guys in the next one. Peace.